so we're back here in the long drive in our massive fort uh, that is, I think, making the vehicle slightly top-heavy, but you know what? I don't care. I love it. it. It's awesome looking, but you know what would make this thing complete? You know what would be the cherry on the top? That would be a machine gun. So the tentacles are here. Now we gotta watch out because if they spawn in and we bump into them, we're gonna die. And that's no joke. Like, they are dead accurate. They will start firing at us. We'll have to, I don't know, maybe grab a Maxwell and be like, oh, you know, hit the Maxwell cat. Uh, not to harm the cat, but we all know the cat has no feelings at the moment. Uh, or at least physical feelings. Now, emotionally, the cat might be scarred. But uh, it won't get hurt, <laughs> and it might block uh, might block me. You know, we need a, uh, I would say maybe a bulletproof vest mod. In here, that would be kind of cool, actually. I mean, you don't really get shot by many things in this, but still, uh, I'd love to see that. Also, I'd love to see you guys hitting the thumbs up button for the If I Die, the Series Ends series. So, uh, yeah, do that too. Uh, it makes me feel good. We, what's happening? Why is my vehicle, oh, my vehicle's peeing. Oh, no, 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 stop, 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 stop. Oh my goodness, oh, jeez. Okay, I feel like an elderly person at a gas station. I think I left my vehicle, the gas caps open. Uh, the only bad thing is you don't actually have, like, a cap, so the cover's open, and it's been spilling. Oh, I still have 24 liters. That's not that bad. By the way, do you guys like what I did with the inside of the... <coughs> hey, I was trying to tell a story here. You know, get in there, Jimmy. Uh, oh? No, I didn't ask your opinion. I was asking the viewer's opinion of the inside of this. We added the chair here. We got a TV for Maxwell. Uh, did a lot of stuff to the interior. I actually quite like it. Got a couple, uh... A little gun stored there. We got some baskets on the outside. We added this back piece. Uh, I got a uh, nice big level here. When I was thinking about finding one of those technical guns, I'd probably mount it here, or I might even mount it on the back. I, I don't know. What do you guys think? Haunted oh, here vehicle. Technical? No. Just random person. Hey, look at me. Look at me. Oh, they won't even look at me. Uh, also, oh, that's a junkyard down there. Um, I might have lost <laughs> my binoculars. Yeah, I was using those to jump up, and I was in a haunted house, and I dumped them on a shelf. But nonetheless, uh, my old person phase is over. We've got the gas cap closed, or the cover, and let's go ahead and make it up the road. Uh, I see a billboard coming up. We're starting to climb again. Like, I thought we were going down in the nice, flat desert, but nope. It's like we're going right back up a mountain, you know, just trying to give you guys, or trying to give me more chances to die here. Okay, we got a nice little bit of a view. I mean, it'd be nice if I had binoculars right now. I can kind of see what we're coming up to. I see stops. I, I think I see a tanker over there, but my goodness, there's not really much, like, in the area. Uh, a bit on the concerning side, especially if I want to find a truck that's got a machine gun on it. I mean, we could maybe steal one? Uh, we don't get to keep it if we save the game and reload, but at least, a, you know, try it on for size. We'll call it borrowing. Like, I'll probably have to run somebody off the road. I might have to, you know, shoot him in the face. Uh, I got ammo for that. And, uh, oh, I had a turbo on me? Oh, yeah, this is small. Well, I actually really don't need this thing. Here, you, you go out there, turbo. Yeah, it's small. It doesn't match my other turbo, so according to the mod maker, that is not effective. You have to have similar turbos. And I have a giant one on here. Uh, but yeah, uh, I got ammo, so we could take the driver out. It's risky, though. Like, I guess you want to take out maybe the gunner first, then go for the driver. Uh, and then maybe take their weapon. What is that over there? Oh, that's one of those old houses. That might, that might have a truck in it. Hold on, let's turn here. I try not to turn too fast anymore because I am definitely top heavy. Like when I turn, you could feel the weight shift of the vehicle and it continues to turn without me even turning the wheel because it's just shifted over. Yeah, it's a kind of a dangerous situation we put ourselves in by creating a Ford on top of this, but you guys like the Ford, so. I mean, I gotta do what you guys like, right? Like, why would you be watching the videos if you didn't like this? Not unless there's just somebody that just doesn't like me and they just like to watch my videos to be like, man, that guy's a stupid person. Watch, <laughs> you know, oddly enough, people watch YouTubers out of spite. Like, I hate this guy so much, I'm gonna watch all of his videos just to prove how much I hate him. Ooh, free cactus. Mmm, water. Uh, okay, oh, brakes, 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 brakes. You guys got a truck in here? Technical? Big machine gun? You ever seen one? Uh, no, you don't have a truck. Do you have anything that I want? Before I engage, I see there's two mutants in there. Oh my goodness. There's cacti all in this thing. Uh, go ahead and get a drink there. Maxwell, you guys, uh, are you supposed to get... Wait, can cats eat cacti? I think that's a thing, right? Okay, do you got anything that I actually want here? Unfortunately, you don't have one of the technicals, so... I mean, I'm not really interested in you, to be honest. 
Uh, anything around here? No, 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 no. I don't think you get the, like, the machine guns. I don't think they'll actually spawn. Oh, there's a bug in there. No, I'm good. All right, you guys, uh, you have fun doing whatever you're doing in there. I'm gonna go head up the road and see if I can find myself a machine gun. Okay, it's kind of got me thinking here. Let's pull over. I, I don't feel safe at the moment. Like, think about it. We're on such a hardcore series that if I get shot, there's a good chance I'm dying. So, hmm. Do we have something in here I can kind of cover the window? Like, I want to give myself a chance. Uh, we're not going to mount Maxwell's to the window because that's just cruel. Uh, even though I did say I'd use one as a shield. Maybe I should take off one of these pallet pieces. The only problem is I take off a pallet piece, I am not going to be able to see. Uh, the grill's not porous enough, I don't think. I mean, I could stick it up here like that. You know, maybe we should do that. I'm going to stick it about right here. Uh, and then let's go attach. Just for right now, that way if I do, like somebody tries to light me up, hopefully they hit the grill piece before they hit me. Like, I gotta give myself every chance possible here. I mean, it's actually not that bad. Like visibility, like I thought that was gonna be a lot worse. I think I've done this before with a vehicle. I kind of like it to be honest with you. All right, let's go, uh, let's keep moving here. I, I wanna track something down. Plus, you know what? We're just, we're doing the thing. We're getting to day 100. Like, nobody thought I was going to make it this far. Nobody. Like, everybody was like, oh, you're going to die by, like, day 10 or 20. But, I mean, come on. Look at where we're at. My goodness, look at that absolutely stunning view. Look at how the, uh, it falls off there. That is a very, very deep-looking valley. Uh, are we turning towards this? I mean, I'm kind of game if we are. Oh, look at this. Uh, we got two stops here. We got a garage, and we are right beside a tanker, so got to take advantage of that. Technical? No, that looks like a... Was that a Tremont? Uh, okay. We're going to camp here for the night. There's a good chance there's a mutant inside of here. Oh, my goodness. It is quite bumpy. Hold on, kitties. Uh, it's going to be fine. You think they got any pallets in here, too? I mean, we can keep adding to the base. And Oh, man. I can hear somebody coughing. You know, you got to lay off them cigarettes, buddy. Pretty sure that's what the mutants are doing here. Oh. Oh. What the? It sounds like it was walking like towards me. Wait, what is this over here? Oh, there's a piece of the van over. Oh, it's a good like wood piece over here. Okay, there's a couple things that I can uh, I can hang with. Okay, buddy. Wait, what's that sound? Oh, Fury, Fury cop. Okay, I was thinking maybe technical. Where where is he? Oh my goodness, where the where did he come from? Was he on the left side of the door there? I didn't even see him when I walked in. Editor, um, can we get a replay when I open up the door? Was he there? Um, that was crazy. Okay, ooh, binoculars, finally. Okay, we got our binoculars back. I'm gonna wait for day, because I can't really see in here. It, just because, like, I really don't want to miss, just in case the, I think the machine gun does spawn in, like, by itself, uh, where you don't have to rip it off a technical. So I think I want to go to sleep, that way I can see. And uh, plus, you know, <laughs> visibility means less chance of death when I'm driving. All right, another glorious morning. Let's see if we can find some parts here. Uh, let's see, gas tank. Does that have fuel in it? Uh, no, it's got some oil in it. You know, I was having a lot of issues cranking my car at the beginning of the last episode. Actually, it was cranked. It wouldn't actually go into drive. And a lot of people pointed out that they think it was my oil that was the issue. And I kind of felt like it might have been, but I was a big goofball. And I was like, man, I have no clue what's wrong with my vehicle. And it took me forever to actually truly figure out what was going on. Uh, but yeah, I think it was the oil. So no engine issues. Um, I want to use this piece. This is a, it's a nice piece, actually. I could try to coat this. That's like armor. Like, that's two layers there. If I were to find another piece like that, I could stick it on the other side. That makes it look a little bit more built up, opposed to just a bunch of pallets stuck together. Uh, so kind of dig that. Hold on, let's break open this thing over here. Uh, anything up on top of these? What is this? Oh, it's a gauge cluster for the Fury. Nice. All right, let's, uh, come on. Machine gun? Uh, no, oil. I mean, I could take some oil. Let's just go ahead and just stick it to the side of the car. Never know we'll need it. Also, I did find this, uh, not too long ago. I finally have the sniper rifle. I don't have any bullets for it, but I mean, I got the sniper with the scope on it. Looks pretty cool. Uh, okay, well, now that we have binoculars, I obviously I'm gonna stop down in here, get some fuel. Uh, we'll probably do that off camera. Is there anything, anything interesting out here? You know, I found another, oh, by the way, I'm not going to open that. That is clearly feet in there. Um, I found another mine, uh, a couple episodes ago and it was also empty. Like, I don't know why I have zero luck with the mine stops popping up and there being nothing in it. To be fair, well, no, actually I had two of them, I believe. One was like halfway filled up with nothing, but it was like the ground was going through it. And then you had the original one, which there's nothing out here right now. My goodness. 
Yeah, and you had like a new one and it still didn't have anything in it. So now I'm like, what is actually in the mine? Uh, I'm sure a lot of comments have said like what's in theirs, but I have yet to see anything. Uh, I'm going to head down to the uh, tanker here and then we're going to get back on the road. Well, I'm not having too much luck out here finding any sort of technical, any sort of stops that are really meaningful at the moment. But I do have an idea. So traffic's obviously spawning in. Why don't I set up a roadblock? Maybe have like a rock over to the side, like find a rock close to the road. I can set over there with Maxwell and we can ambush a technical and try to get its stuff. I mean, I could even take a couple pallets off and then make like a barrier. That way I'm somewhat safe. I don't know, does that sound like a good or a bad idea? I'm not really sure. I mean, all I got to do is shoot the driver first, the, or actually the gunner first. That way they can't open fire. The driver will be easy to take care of. Also, my goodness, talk about, oh, oh, look at how high up they went. That's a new record right there. That was beautiful. My goodness, that cop flew. Um, yeah, look at the uh, biome change here. We're like up on a hill. We're going to shoot down. It looks like we're going to go into the grass area, which, I mean, hopefully that means good stops. This might be a... Not a bad spot for an ambush. Uh, okay. What we're gonna do... I mean, it's a nice straight piece of road, so I can see the vehicles coming. I don't have really much cover out here. Okay, so just kind of uh, position ourselves like this. Is this... Is this safe? I don't know if this is safe or not. Okay, brakes. Oh, I hear something coming. <gasps> not a technical... Hey, slow down! Slow down! My goodness! How... What are you doing with your hand? How long did you see me there? Why did you run into me? Okay. Now, this is fine. Operation Roadblock has started. Let's go ahead and get out. Uh, okay, how much? I think I've got, what, 15 bullets here? I think I got more in the back. All right, I'm going to set here for a second. Let's see if we can get a technical to spawn in, and then I can steal its weapon. I still need to find one of my own, but I just want to see what it looks like and see how well it works mounted up on my fort. Oh, okay. Yep, there goes another person in. That lady over there looks really, really shocked. Oh, okay, they're spawning in. No, why are they spawning in over there? Uh, I just watched a Fury spawn in. I'm going to be so ticked if I see a technical spawn in, but it goes the opposite way. All right, give it a little bit. Oh, oh, okay, that's a diesel. No, that's not what I'm looking for. Let's see, what are we... Oh, my goodness! What the... Okay, well, that's one way to clear the roadblock out, you jerk. <sighs> Come on, we're in a good spot. I seem to be getting a lot of vehicle spawns here. By the way, do I see any other stops? Oh, oh and something's coming. No, never mind, it's just a taxi. Hey, dude, you can... Oh, technical? No, not a technical. Hold on, let the car crash happen real quick. Bye, lose it. Okay, taxi. No, seriously, I don't... No, you can just go away. Like, I don't want you here. Okay, take this out. There you go. Okay, Are you, you got your parking... You're in the way. You're blocking my roadblock. There you go. That's what you deserve. Okay, just gotta wait. They knocked some of the traffic to the side. We still have a good roadblock going here, though. Oh, where... Where is my technical at? What is... Oh, my goodness. Here comes the... Oh, here's the fuzz. Uh, hello, officer. We're totally not doing anything illegal here. We're just blocking the road. We're doing a wellness check. Um, how are you? You don't even look like an officer. Where's your uniform at? Where, where's the little cap that you guys normally wear? I don't see anything. You got a dead body in here? See, I'm doing reverse psychology on the cop here. It's like, hey, this is normally my job. Well, you know what? My job is to disable your cop car and watch you roll back down the hill. Goodbye. Thank you. I like how when you take the engine out, the AI just freezes. And there they go. Okay, let's try not to get too distracted here. Oh, they're breaking the laws of physics. They're going uphill without an engine in reverse. Hold on, it might stall out and they might roll back the other way. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, there they go. Goodbye. Wait, do you still have the wheel turn? No, turn the wheel to the left. I want to watch you roll down the hill to your death. Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to go back up here with my roadblock. You, you have fun doing it, whatever you're doing. Looks kind of strange. Oh my goodness. Here comes another taxi. You've got to be kidding me. Stop with the... Oh, no. Stop with the taxis. I don't need a lift. There's too many of you. Oh, my goodness. There's too many of y'all out here. Wait, hold on. What's that? Uh, van. Okay. I kind of got an eye on the fir front of it. I didn't kind of pay attention to the back. I thought maybe that could have been the technical. Oh, uh, we are creating a laggy mess. Maybe I should stand a little further. Oh, there goes another. Nope, that's a taxi. I think we got to move here, folks. We are in a bad spot. There's too many cars spawned in all in one area. Uh, I'm going to drive further down. It was worth the shot. Uh, a little disappointed we didn't get a technical, but we got many funny moments there because... What? If you know, doing that is not going to make your vehicle go any faster. I'm just saying. Also, that lady over there looks really shocked at that lady. And then this person's just staring at me, wondering, why did you do this? Uh, I need to, I need to get out of here. Uh, I need it. There we go. Okay. You're really smoking up the inside of my vehicle. I'm going to, I'm going to crank it and leave. Okay. 
Uh, have fun. Hopefully you enjoy Komodo's Roblox. Oh my goodness. Am I stuck? Oh, I might be stuck right now. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. All right. Bye, loser. Uh, have fun doing whatever you're going to do. Oh, I am stuck on top of the tow truck. Oh, come on. Come on. There it goes. All right. Yeah, have fun blowing up your motor over there. Well, that was annoying. I was hoping to find the uh, technical and I got zero. Oh, hold on to your butt cheeks. It's about to get a little bit bumpy. Look at the road up here. Oh, this is okay. This is really steep. Let's start to slow down. We do have a stop. Could it be something that's got a lot of loot in it? I'm hoping so. Brakes, 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 brakes. What is this place over here? Another garage, maybe? Or something else? Oh, you know, it might be a uh, another supermarket. The supermarket doesn't sell guns, does it? I don't think that's a thing. Hold on. Also, something else has caught my eye. We don't... Ooh. I hear something walking around in there. Should I... Hold on. Oh, there's definitely a mutant in there. Real quick. What is... Oh, I need to get out real quick. Okay, very, very quiet. I don't think the mutant can really hear. Folks, you see that smooth rock right there? I guarantee you that's a bunker. I don't know how it spawned in. I'm tempted to go over. I've, dude, every bunker I've been to, or I say bunker, it's a mine. Everyone that I've been to has been a bust. I'm not going to go in here. Oh, and let's circle it just in case I do see a gun. I uh, see binoculars. You don't keep a technical in here, do you? I mean, I'd hate to waste my ammo. I mean, I got more ammo in the bag. <sighs> Should we? No, I'm skipping. I'm skipping. Let's just keep going. I don't even want to mess with that mutant. But yeah, there is definitely a mine on the right side. What if there's a technical? Well, I've never seen a vehicle. Well, I've never seen anything at the mine. You know, just to show you guys how big of a bust the mines have been for me. We are going to this one. It's not that far away. Road will be to the left side. We could totally make it to this thing. Uh, maybe we finally get lucky and there's actually stuff in here, but I'm kind of doubting it. Uh, but let's go over there anyway. So yeah, road to the left. We had a... Did we even change the biome? No, the biome didn't change up there. I thought maybe it like flashed from like grass to back to desert, back to grass, but it uh, looks pretty clear here. Also, I wonder if the watchtowers, if the technical would randomly spawn there, because you get a lot of weapons at those. Wait, what the heck is it? This is a mine, isn't it? Wait, this is... No, it is. It is. It's kind of spawned in weird. Well, maybe it's just the terrain hasn't fully loaded in. Wait, is this the mine? Yeah, this is the mine, right? Hold on, let's go around this side. Look for an opening. Oh my goodness, this one's actually got freaking loot in it. Nice. Well, you know what? Maybe we'll find our gun here. I saw... I think I hear mutants. All right, let me go grab more ammo real quick. Okay, we are ready to go. We need a flashlight attachment for the gun. Well, with the attach... Oh, hold on. In theory... I can attach, nope, 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 don't want that. I want this. Can I attach this to the end of the gun? Or at least onto the side of it? Hold on, this might be freaking genius if I can do this. Oh my goodness, that worked. Wait, why have I not thought of to do this? Yo, that's legit a good flashlight. Like, I mean, it's definitely would help at night. Uh, hey buddy, hey buddy. Ooh. Okay, okay, I definitely hear another one in here. Is there an actual way to turn the lights on? Maybe there was up there. Come on, reload. Ooh, I just dropped four bullets, that's fine. Okay, we've got our flashlight. Okay, left side, all right. Ooh. Listen for more. Okay, where's the bottom of this thing? What is down here? Yo, oh my good, dude, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, I need to hit the power button over here. That way I can get the lights on. Ooh. Okay, there is a ton of loot in these things. Boom, nice, I like this. We finally have stuff. Dude, they set up like a whole little base down in here. Honestly, this is kind of impressive that the mutants did this. Hold on, editor's favorite moment. I gotta eat some, I don't know if that's a dinner roll or if that is cheese. Uh, I'm gonna go with the dinner roll. I think I've asked that before. Uh, oh, you guys got some TV. What, what are you guys watching over here? You're watching 1980 or 1978. Oh, it's talking about the world ending. Uh, that makes sense, doesn't it? Uh, okay, I need to break these open. We got flashlights and stuff down here. Let's just turn some of these on. Just give ourselves a little bit of extra light. I don't hear any more mutants. Uh, do you guys have a couch down here? I might just stay the night in this mine, to be honest with you. That'd be, I think it'd be perfectly fine. Yeah, where do you guys sleep at? I mean, you gotta obviously have all this stuff down here, but I don't see any, uh, sleeping areas. It's kind of weird. All right, let's turn this one on here, set it across. Uh, there we go. Okay, uh, the things have, all the, like, the crates have been a bust so far. That's a radiator. Uh, come on, give me a weapon. Give me a technical or something. Uh, I want that mounted machine gun. I don't, that looked like poo in that one. Who poops in a crate? Oh, and you got our, uh, lovely cones here. Oh, there's another one off in the corner. You know, actually a little bit of lag because of how many crates I've broken. There's a ton in here. What was, wait, what was that? 
And no, ah, oh, no, no, I need to walk back over. I need my stupid freaking binoc. I hear rabbits outside. That's not the first time I've heard that. That one's obviously filled with hands. Uh, let's just fire that one open. Okay, <sighs> oil. Well, I mean, we have a stop here. There's a lot of barrels. What is in this? Oil, alcohol. You got blood in any of these? Oil. I mean, it's a good stop. Is it worth uh, dealing with the mutants? These all seem to have alcohol and oil. Oh, that one had gas in it. I could probably bring that. Actually, no, I've already filled up. That one's got a lot of gas in it. You know, gas just really isn't an issue. That's the weird thing. Even with the hardcore mode, I would figure that that would be like a thing you wouldn't see as much of. I gotta grab my binoculars, by the way. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I'm always like full of gas. That, that sounds bad. Uh, let's go back to the top. There's still more I could break down. Let's use the elevator though, if it doesn't kill us. Oh, and do I see, okay, I think I see the top. There we go, nice. Okay, real quick, we got one more out here. Watch this be the one with the gun in it. Boom, what did that have? That had, what did that have? Uh, oh, it's got a, well, there's a machine gun. It's not the gun I was wanting, but that's 30 more bullets. So I'll grab that off. Uh, I guess we're just going to camp here for the night. There was nowhere to sleep down in there. Uh, roads to the left. But you know what? I am super happy. We finally found uh, a freaking mine that actually had stuff in it. Whoa, whoa. Technical, technical, it just came flying through the sky. No, 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 turn it around, turn it around. Oh my goodness, that's what I need. Oh, they broke their tire too. Hold on. My goodness. I was going to scream, oh, another distance record because it just appeared out of nowhere, but uh, how are you going that fast? Okay, we do not need to make contact with these people. We've got to, what is going on with the arms there? We've got to slow them down here. Hey, slow down, slow it down. I need you to pull over, please. Pull over the vehicle. Pull over, don't you speed by me. Pull your vehicle over. Uh, we got him. Oh, this is the moment of truth. We got to be really careful here. Oh, I didn't grab. Oh, my other magazine's on. Do I need the other magazine? Let me grab it real quick. It's in the side. Okay, reload. Okay. All right. We got to take the gunner out. What are we going to do? Uh, what are you doing? Don't run into my vehicle. Don't do that. Don't run into them. Wait, run into them. Oh, okay. Oh, we're about to try this. This might be the end of the series here. And... Oh, we got it on. Right, take the driver out real quick. Uh, pull over. Uh, we can grab this off the top of this, right? Hold on. Can I, can I, wait, can I not grab this the whole time? I could have swore I could take this thing off. Uh, what is wrong with your freaking arms? Sit. Wait. I, uh, can you only find these out in the wild? Yeah, I could have swore you could rip them off the car like a normal piece, but maybe you can only find them out in the wild. I don't see any prompt to like grab it. Oh, I might have just taken you guys out for no reason. I'm sorry, Miss Extremely Long Arms that are kind of creeping me out. Kind of reminds me of SCP-096. But you gotta be kidding me. So we gotta find one of these. We either have to find the gun just randomly out or we have to find the whole vehicle. Yeah, that was kind of pointless for me to shoot you guys. I apologize. Not that that really matters at the moment. But honestly, it was scaring the poo-poo out of me because I thought, man, we were about to get in a gunfight. But one good, uh, you know, nice headshot there. We took out our competition. All right, time to... Oh, really? Was that necessary? Can't tell me you couldn't have stopped your vehicle there, sir. All right, you know what? Let's get moving. We got a lot more ground to make up. But we have a pretty solid plan. I kind of like this grill piece. I need to find another one of these vans uh, and just put the normal grill back on. But I feel like now that we have the technicals in the world, we must probably armor this thing up. But we survived more days. We found a mine. We got our technical, not in the way that we really wanted to get it. But nonetheless, you guys know the plan, and we'll see you guys next time.